Alright, hello guys, and welcome to a Season 9 Cup game. Uh, it's the first one of these we've had in a while, I think. Uh, we're at the top 8 now, so not a whole lot of games left. But the deadline for top 8 is tomorrow, so we'll probably see some more of these coming up. Uh, today we have Phoenix Fox playing Dragon versus Woodwind playing Scorpion. Um, I know both of these guys are really good players, so this should be a good match. So it looks like Scorpion is going to be going first here. Um, interesting flip. Uh, we see the young rumor monger played with one fate, so probably just going to take the passing fate after this. There's the Kitsuki Investigator. Uh, Investigator is a really good card to see in this matchup. You want to make sure you can get rid of those Fate Worse Than Deaths before they hit anybody important. Um, so yeah, Scorpion does take the f Passing Fate, and Dragon's going to use that Storehouse there. Could have played a Doom Chugendra, but probably better to just save the Fate, right? Uh, both players bid 5, as expected. Ooh, interesting. So, it looks like Woodwind is splashing Dragon. He's actually running three Let Go, two Tattooed Wanderers. So, no Hawk Tattoos to worry about. Um, we see a Goblin Sneak going to take a Fate. There's a Seal of the Dragon. If he has another Goblin Sneak, he can take the last Fate here, and then uh, the only way to investigate would be if he hit a Fire Province. Looks like he's just going to go for a military attack first here, though. Uh, you could go... Okay, he's going Void, finds Restoration of Balance, so he's going to have to discard a few cards. Only three, so not too bad. Um, and this should be a break on Restoration, which is probably fine for Dragon. Like, Scorpion generally doesn't win by breaking your stronghold, they win by dishonoring you. Discards I Can Swim, Cloud the Mind, and Meek Informant. Hmm. So there are only two clouds in the deck, so only one of those left now. Um, and that was the only Meek Informant and I Can Swim. So he knows that those cards are gone. Uh, we do see the break there, going to take a fate off of the Investigator with the Void Ring. And Phoenix Fox passes the Conflict Opportunity. Uh, it would have been nice for Scorpion to hit Sacred Sanctuary there, maybe. Although he could have had some kind of military buff. So you might not be able to prevent the break. Uh, you would at least get to defend both Conflicts, though. Woodwind is going to pass his second conflict, so now... Ooh, there's a Pathfinder's Blade, that's good. Uh, so now Dragon has to either... Ooh, and a Finger of Jade as well, nice. So Dragon either has to attack here or give up his chance to use Investigator this turn, both of which are pretty bad. Um, he has to worry about, if he hits a Void Province, Scorpion will gain a Fate from Seeker of Void, and he will have exactly enough to play Fate Worse Than Death. Um, but fortunately Dragon has this Finger of Jade, so he should be able to prevent that from coming out. And he also has the Pathfinder's Blade, so if he runs into, like, Shameful Display, he can just cancel that. Uh, he's gonna find Secret Cache. You cancel this too, I imagine. Yep. Don't want Scorpion to be getting more cards. Um, contesting the Earth Ring, that's good. If he wins this, then Scorpion... So Investigator plus Earthring brings Scorpion down to two cards, which is not where he wants to be. Um, 
So do you defend this? If you don't defend this, then you win favor. If you do defend this, then you have to win the conflict to win the favor. Scorpion does have censure in the deck, uh, but probably doesn't have any in hand. We see a court game is going to dishonor the investigator there. So they are now tied. Um, investigator uses the ability, spending the fate to the firing, finds four shame and two way of the scorpions. Uh, discards four shame, that's probably correct. Way of the scorpion is a dead card right now, since he's already dishonored. And then Earthring will hit one of those as well. Woodwind uses the Imperial Storehouse, uh, waiting until after the Investigator gets triggered for that. That's good. Uh, the Earthring is going to hit away the Scorpion, so we don't know what card he drew there, unless it was the third way of the Scorpion, I guess. But we don't know that if it is. Uh, Imperial Favor will stay unclaimed, and this seems like probably a good spot for Dragon, right? So he's up six cards, which is a lot. He's only down three fate, which is not a big deal. Finds another investigator here and an alchemist as well. Alchemist is pretty good. Um, although he doesn't, he's not going to have a lot of fate here. He's probably going to go for this firing though, uh, and also potentially get the passing fate. Like Scorpion really needs to play a character, right? He only has two cards in his hand. So he can't really rely on just drawing the cards that he needs, I think. Yeah, so we see the Sochi Illusionist. Uh, Dragon does get the Passing Fate there. You can play the Young Rumormonger now. That's probably fine. Or you can just pass. Yep, he does play the Rumormonger. Both players will bid five. Uh, we see another Pathfinder's Blade on the Investigator, so... Hmm, do you attack another face-down province, or do you just go at Secret Cache again? The problem with Master Alchemist is that these Rumor Mongers are just going to redirect the honor to her, and then Illusionist can remove it. Uh, he is going to go down at a face-down province, finds Shameful Display... So he actually doesn't necessarily have to use the Pathfinder's Blade on this. Um, if Scorpion uses it right away, that's just going to honor the Illusionist, right? It's two to three. Yeah, so you can probably just... Ooh, Woodwind passes. Okay, so we're going to save Shameful. Uh, that's probably good. Uh, investigator spends a Fate to the Watering, finds Fate Worse than... Ooh, two Fate Worse than Deaths, two Centures. Court Games, Forge Edict, Way of the Scorpion. So the Centures are turned off. Forge Edict is the only cancel currently in his hand. But you really need to get rid of these Fate Worse than Deaths, right? Uh, unfortunately, you can only get rid of one here. I think you still discard a fate worse than death, right? Like, if you see that in the hand, you pretty much always discard it. Yeah, that is what he's going to do. But yeah, unfortunately, since he does have both of them in hand, he can play the other one on the Master Alchemist this turn. Um, so he spent our fate to the watering there. So he wants, he really wants Scorpion to go for this watering. He doesn't want Scorpion to go like Void or Earth or something. Uh, so he wants to incentivize that more. We see a Court Games to honor a friendly character. So if this gets moved to Alchemist, then Alchemist can honor Investigator. And then if he Shameful Displays, you just Pathfinder's Blade and you're fine. Um, and then you can Stronghold for the break.
Although if he if he discards it with the Soshi Illusionist right away, he can move the other honor as well. He does get an action in there. Um plus we know he has Way of the Scorpion, so and court games actually. Yeah, so Scorpion's actually just gonna let that go through. Uh do you try to shameful now? I think you do, yeah, he does. So you definitely Pathfinder's Blade that. And then now what? <clears throat> you just stronghold, I guess. Uh, we see a seal of the dragon on the master alchemist? Question mark. Interesting. Uh, there is the Stronghold. Shameful Display is breaking, so Scorpion needs to dishonor him again now. Was wondering why Woodwind had so few cards. Yeah, uh, it was Restoration, two Investigates, and an Earth Ring on turn one. So Restoration hit three cards, uh, Investigator hit another card, Earth Ring hit another card, that's five, and then this turn Investigator got another one, so... He's discarded six cards out of Woodwind's hand so far. Um, what bug? Apparently there's a bug with the rumor monger. Yeah, it's pretty good to have card advantage uh, versus Scorpion, that's true. What just happened? Okay, so he did play the court games. Uh, the alchemist tried to honor, but it got redirected. So she illusion is going to remove that. Seems good. So you're still winning, but not breaking here. Um, of course, the other firing will probably get redirected again, but you can still just try to re-honor your investigator. Ooh, he plays a Void Fist. I was wondering if we were going to see that. Uh, we do know, again, that he has a Forged Edict in hand. So he can Forged Edict this if he so chooses. Let's see if he does decide to do that. Yep, that is what we see. So Scorpion's running out of cards. If he has another Void Fist in hand, he can just play it now. I have to imagine he has something else, right? Or maybe, I guess maybe he just wanted to get rid of that uh, Forged Edict. We'll see. Still has nine cards. Nope, just going to be a pass. And yeah, he's going to re-honor the Kitsuki Investigator. Uh, you probably don't move this, right? Because then the Master Alchemist is honored. Maybe you do. I'm not sure. We'll see. Uh, nope, not going to move it. I think that's probably correct. He still has the Way of, Scorp Way of the Scorpion in his hand as well. Uh, so we're going to see a military attack. Military water at Sacred Sanctuary. Ooh. Um, so he is going to get that fate. So who do you use Sacred Sanctuary on here? Probably the Investigator, right? No, he uses it on Alchemist. Hmm. Okay, he has a Finger of Jade. Nice. So can't fate worse than death now. I kind of expected him to use it on the Investigator, though, because then you can defend with both, and then the Investigator will still be able to defend the political attack. So away the Scorpion, going to Dishonor, as expected. 
And the problem now is that you can't let this break, right? Like, that's pretty bad. Uh, maybe he has a sword or a bonsai or something. Bonsai would be good. Watering doesn't do a whole lot. He has a tattooed wander, okay. That does prevent the break. Uh, hurricane punch would be good here. Although... Ooh, we have a let go on the fine katana there. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, the only attachments that you're really worried about in the Scorpion deck, I guess, are the one Fiery Madness and two Cloud the Mind. And we've already seen one of the Cloud the Minds get discarded, so... Probably not going to have too much to do with those let goes. Um... Scorpion could, of course, Fate Worse Than Death the Tattooed Wanderer, but that would be pretty bad. It wouldn't even get him the break. So I expect him to just pass here. I think that's the only thing he can do, right? His hand right now is two centuries and Fate Worse Than Death. Yeah, so he should. I think he's just going to pass here. Uh, the problem then for Dragon is that you can't really defend this political attack. You can attack Void, maybe. Uh, you have a free attack at Shameful. So you can go there with the Void, or you could also go Earth. Um, and hope that you hit that Fate Worse Than Death, so you don't have to worry about that for the rest of the game. Yeah, we do see the Pass. So that is going to be it there. Yeah, I think you actually have to go Void here, because if you let him attack Void and you can't win that conflict, then your Investigator dies, right? So yeah, I would definitely attack Void. Um, it's kind of unfortunate that he's going to Earthring you back, but what are you going to do? If he has like a Hurricane Punch here, that's really good. You don't necessarily have to break this, I guess. Uh, we actually see a defense here. So Woodwind is winning now. So yeah, he's banking on Dragon not having any more military buffs. Uh, this seems a little bit risky. I feel like I would have rather just gotten that free Earth Ring. But no, he doesn't have any military buffs, so that's going to work out. Dragon will get the favor, though. So, let's see. Who are you going to discard here? Um, Scorpion is still in a pretty bad spot with the hand sizes. Um, of course, both players are going to continue to bid 5. But he'll still be down 3 cards. And this Investigator is going to keep firing. Ooh, and we see Mitsu and Yokuni here. Hmm... Neither of these are actually good buys right now, and the neither is the Niten Master, because you know he has the Fate Worse Than Death, and you need to save Fate for using these two abilities. So this is actually pretty bad. I think I would have maybe kept the Togashi Initiate. Uh, we see Kudaka 3 Fate. I would actually... Cons like, I'm considering just passing here as Dragon, right? Bonding Diplomat looks kind of good, actually, if Dragon passes here. Because he has two centuries in hand. Yeah, so Dragon is just going to pass. Um, there's the Kudaka duplicate. She has four fate. Wow. That's going to be here for a while. So yeah, both players bid five. As expected, once again. Uh, Scorpion has the first attack. So you probably attack Sacred Sanctuary, right? You could go for the air ring here, that seems good. 
Um, the only problem, of course, is if you go political, then Investigator gets to do his thing. Dragon still doesn't really have a good province to attack. Um, I mean, I guess he can attack. Mm, it feels kind of bad. He has the Finger of Jade to cancel Shameful, potentially, but he has to take care of that to pay it worse than death. So, still waiting here. Um, the Goblin Sneak is interesting. I think Scorpion will probably attack air, right? Like, that just seems good here. Uh, still waiting here for Phoenix Fox to take an action. There's the pass. Ooh, he's actually going fire. Okay, so this is going to be military fire here. The young rumor mongers have been pretty good this game. So he does go at Sacred Sanctuary, that's going to get used on the Master Alchemist here. Ooh, there's a Hurricane Punch. Always good to see those. So it's 3-3 three to three now. It's 
see a pass, uh, so he can stronghold if he wants. It's going to use Master Alchemist on itself. Yeah, and we're going to see the Young Rumormonger. Uh, looks like there is a bug with that that's not letting him trigger it. But yeah, he is going to redirect the honor to the investigator there. I mean, he's not going to finger of Jade that, right? Do you? Yeah, no, you don't. Uh, what turn is this? This is turn three. Dragon has a pretty good card advantage that he's been holding on to this whole game th thanks to a turn, turn one restoration and investigator. Um, ooh, Bonsai. Is he going to big Bonsai? No, just small Bonsai. I think that's probably right. Um, so Scorpion could move somebody home here with the favorable ground. Could move home the Rumor Monger, maybe. Dragon still has the stronghold here and is threatening Void Fist as well. Yeah, so there's the move home on the Rumor Monger. Seems good. So now you just pass. This, this political attack coming up here is going to be pretty tough. Um, Dragon could attack with the air ring and try to get Scorpion to overcommit on defense so that he can't try and break the Sacred Sanctuary. I think that's what we might see. Um... I wonder what he's thinking about here. <sighs> hmm. Like, yeah, I'm not really sure what he could have in his hand that he would want to play. Uh, one thing that would be good is if he has some kind of conflict character, maybe. Ooh, plays a Hawk Tattoo to move in the Illusionist. That seems good. And I don't think Scorpion can do anything about that. Probably just pass now, right? Uh, we see a fine katana on the goblin sneak. So you can just, uh, yeah, you can play a fine katana on your own character. That works also. Uh, Dragon, again, still has the box here, but would probably like to save that for the political conflict.
So dra Dragon is going to win that conflict. Um, so you could do a military attack now maybe with the Alchemist. Going into Shameful Display is actually not too bad. Um, he is going to pass the conflict though. Interesting. So the problem now is that if Woodwind passes his conflict, uh, you have to do a political, and the Alchemist isn't really contributing anything for that, so... Might have maybe been better to uh, just go ahead and use her on an attack there. The Social Illusionist is going to discard the Honored status token here. It's fine. Uh, so Scorpion has six political skill. Dragon has uh, seven after he uses the stronghold, I think. So this still looks good for Dragon, actually, I think, if Woodwind does attack. So yeah, I would probably consider just passing my attack as Woodwind. Um, or doing a poke attack with just the Rumor Monger to take Fate off a ring and hopefully force a defense. Yeah, looks like that's what we might see here. You can attack Sanctuary for free, and if he doesn't defend, then it breaks. Uh, so just, yeah, go ahead and take the Earth Ring and go, or sorry, the Air Ring and go there. Seems good. So you defend this with the investigator, right? You look at the hand immediately. And you take, well, first you check to make sure there's nothing else you need to worry about. Ooh, and there is. Uh, that cunning magistrate is actually pretty worrisome. So is the ambush. I think you discard the cunning magistrate here, actually. Like, that's actually bigger than Fate Worse Than Death since you have Finger of Jade. Um, although next turn he'll probably be buying a character without Finger of Jade. Yeah, so he does discard the Fate Worse Than Death, actually. That's possibly a little bit risky here. Um, you should be fine this conflict. He has no way to dishonor your investigator, so you're just going to win this conflict. It's all fine, uh, but now this next conflict, yeah, double censure, pretty awkward, that's true. Uh, he could technically ambush this fawning diplomat to steal the favor, but that feels pretty bad, right? Like, you should have just p played it for three fate. Ooh, attacks a face down province and finds meditations. Um... So he's going to finger of Jade the Meditations, right? Like, you can't just let your alchemist die for free. Uh, but Dragon is going to need a way to honor this Master Alchemist, because otherwise the Cunning Magistrate is just going to stop it. Oh, actually, he didn't discard the Cunning Magistrate, so you can ambush the Diplomat and the Magistrate if you want. Uh, but then you have to play Magistrate with no fate, which again feels bad. But you're getting the favor, so... Yep, there's the Finger of Jade on Meditations. There's the Cunning Magistrate. And I don't think there's a way for him to honor this character, is there? So you just move home now? You know where Meditations is. Yeah, I think this attack was just to get the fate off of the Earth Ring. Uh, he has Seal of the Dragon, yeah. So he could Void Fist. Um, if he has that in hand, he's played no cards yet, though, so he does have to play two cards first if he wants to do that. 
I think you just favorable ground home. Like, this attack was to do two things. It was to take the fade off the Earth Ring. There was two fade on it. And it was to find out which of these was Meditations and which was uh, the other thing, Pilgrimage. So now that he knows which is which, he can just move home and take the favor. You definitely want to keep the favor so that... I mean, he gets the favor either way, right? So I guess you don't have to move home. Um... We'll see what he has in his hand, though. If he does have a Void Fist and he can turn it on somehow, that would be pretty good. Uh, the Scorpion player's hand is once again dead here. Ambush, Assassinate, and two Centuries. Yeah, so that is just going to be the pass. Uh, so Dragon will still get the favor, so that's good. And he has a Reprieve. I was about to say, if he has a Reprieve, that's really good as well. Uh, next turn, he can attack into this Meditations for free. He can also play a very large Mitsu, knowing that there's no Fate Worse Than Death left. And no I Can Swim, for that matter. So yeah, like I'm just playing Mitsu with like a lot of Fate here, right? Discards, Fawning, Diplomat, interesting. See, I almost wanted to see him play that Fawning Diplomat just to turn those sentries on. I guess you don't really need it that much against Dragon, but... Uh, Dragon still does have a little bit of catching up to do on the board state, but this Mitsu with 5 Fate should help that out pretty nicely. He also flips an Imperial Palace on Sacred Sanctuary. This is actually excellent, so that's a 4 Strength Province now. And if you attack there, then he gets like... Extra Mitsu conflicts. Uh, so that's pretty good. Both players bid 5. So Dragon first player here. Um... Let's see. So you have to watch out for Dishonor cards with this Cunning Magistrate on the board. It's one way of the Scorpion left. Uh, we know in his hand he has Assassinate and Ambush. So we could see Ambush get played here. There's a Cloud the Mind on Me too. Let's see if he has the Let Go. He's only played one so far. Ooh, passes. If he just doesn't have the let go, that's actually pretty bad. Uh, but this Mitsu's going to stay on the board for like the rest of the game, right? So he should be able to draw the let go at some point here. Um, Investigator is going to attack at Meditations, going for that Void Ring. Um, that's good. You definitely want to try and get some kind of board control back, get this Cunning Magistrate off the board as soon as possible. And Meditations is free to attack now, which is nice as well. And you can see the hand here. Uh, does Miyako trigger on Ambush? I don't think so, because Ambush is put into play, not play, right? So yeah, it shouldn't... I don't think it uh, should trigger there. Let me check the wording there. Put those characters into play, yeah. Put into play is not the same as play, so I don't think it triggers. I can check the ruling, though. Yeah, there's, there's no specific ruling about that, but I'm pretty sure that's uh, how it works. Um, investigator is going to see the hand here. 
Bonsai Forged Edict to let go. Hmm. So Forged Edict is tempting, but there are no courtiers on board right now, so that's actually a dead card. Court Games is there too. Uh, I think I would strongly consider the Ambush, actually. Ooh, he does the let go, actually. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, Ambush makes him spend fate, I guess. So, that's okay. Uh, he is just going to let Meditations break. Seems correct. And voids the kind of magistrate. So let's see. Scorpion could go for water here to try and bow the alchemist, I guess. Uh, you don't really want to attack Sanctuary though, right? Seems not good. I guess you could go water with the magistrate. No, it looks like he's going to go military earth. Yeah, you definitely can't risk feast or famine here. That would just be game over. That is true. Uh, so yeah, he's going to go at Sacred Sanctuary. That's going to get used on Mitsu. Okay. Sure. So this is three to four. Uh, we see a pass. We know that there's a Bonsai in hand, right? Yeah, Bonsai is the only card you can play here in this conflict, that is. Or Ambush, you can play Ambush also. Uh, he is going to play Ambush. Puts in Yunako and the Manipulator. Yunako is an extra skill as well. Uh, you can move in the Master Alchemist here. There's a Hurricane Bunch, though. Uh, you can actually cancel this now since you have a courtier in play. I think you probably will cancel it. Yes, he does. Uh, that is going to prevent the break, though, so now Scorpion needs to play the Bonsai. Or use Yunako. You can use Yunako also. We'll see if there's going to be a Void Fist coming down here, though. Uh, if you put another attachment on Mitsu and then box him, you can Void Fist Yunako. Ooh, he has the let go for Cloud the Mind. He was just holding on to that until he saw what was in the Scorpion player's hand. That's pretty good. Um, so you can actually just play Void Fist right now on the Goblin Sneak. Um, I would definitely want to buff myself one more time, though, and then play it on the Yunako. Like... If I have, okay, yeah, we do see a bonsai, so probably, probably big bonsai actually, right? Because Scorpion hasn't played the bonsai yet. Yeah, so you big bonsai here, and then he has to bonsai twice on Yunako, or you're gonna get, uh, you know, void fisted. You could also just let that happen, maybe. Uh, maybe that's what you want to do here. Because then he has to use Mitsu's trigger. Hmm. <laughs> more games, more bits. Thanks for the bits. I appreciate it. Uh, Woodwind passes. So yeah, you Void Fist Yunako now, right? Oh, he plays Pathfinder's Blade. That's fine, also. So now, even if he now even if he bonsai's Yunako, you can just Void Fist. So he'd just be trading it. Um, again, that might be worth doing so that you could get the Mitsu trigger. Yeah, and that is what we're gonna see. 
I think that's correct because now Mitsu can't like Hurricane Punch when he attacks. Unless he has Void Fist in hand, but either way, you're making him spend a Void Fist. Um. Ooh, and we see the <laughs> we see the lose an honor for no effect here on the second resolution of Bonsai. Uh, so that's to turn on his stronghold. That's one of the that's pretty much the only time where it's actually good to do that. Um, so yeah, you Void Fist Junako 100%, right? Or you play a Katana. That's actually better. Now you don't have to Void Fist. Now you can just Stronghold. Yeah, I like this. So that's going to be the pass from Woodwind. Uh, it's going to go ahead and use the Master Alchemist to honor Mitsu, actually. So he actually just wasted the box. Why did he? Why did he stronghold if he was going to do that? That seems weird. I mean, I guess he wants to spend the fate to the firing, so that he can go fire next. I think I would have honored the Alchemist though instead, right? Like, you know what's in Scorpion's hand. You know there's nothing he can do. Um, what is in Scorpion's hand? That's a big vantage, advantage that Phoenix Fox has had this game, is that he just knows what's in Scorpion's hand the whole game. Uh, two centers, court games, and assassinate. So yeah, pretty much just dead cards until he goes for his political attack, and then he can play the court games. So I'm curious to see what Dragon's going to do here. He's going to attack with Mitsu, it looks like. He's definitely going to go fire. Uh, you probably go... You could just break Pilgrimage, or you could break one of these other two. You get to break whatever you want, right? Like, this Mitsu is just so big here. Um... So he is going to choose to break the secret cache. Uses the Pathfinder's Blade to cancel the ability. So Scorpion probably just doesn't defend this, right? Yeah, I think you, yeah, you don't defend this. Uh, pass. Dragon going to do anything else? Oh, so I see. What he can do here is he honors the alchemist and then defends the political conflict, and then he can move Mitsu in and play the Void Fist from his discard pile. If he has two other cards, that is. And then win that conflict. Yeah, so that seems good. So Woodwind should probably just go water here. Get that fate. Ooh, he is going air. Hmm. So he thinks he has a chance to win this, maybe. He has first player next turn. Yeah, that's true, actually. Yeah, so that's fine. Uh, I don't think he can win this, though. He is going to at least make Dragon spend some cards. We see Court Games to honor a friendly character. That's probably going to get countered by a Court Games from the Scorpion player. I mean, you don't have to play it yet. You can just save that. Yeah, using the box was a mistake, I think, um, since he, he did end up honoring it. 
see a pass. So you could just pass here. You don't want him to have this ring though, right? Uh, we see a reprieve on the investigator. Maybe he is going to let him have the ring. Oh wait, he's played two cards now. Yeah, so now he can Void Fist. So that's fine. So you just Void Fist Kudaka. Yep, there it is. Didn't actually matter which one you void fisted since he knew what's in the hand here. Um, oh wait, actually Woodwin hasn't played the court games yet, so yeah, you have to do Kudaka. Phoenix Fox claims the favor 7 to 0. That's pretty wild. And this Kitsuki Investigator stays here for yet another turn. That card has done so much work that, this game. Um, so Dragon is on two breaks left. This Mitsu is going to continue rampaging here, I have to imagine. Uh, finds another Master Alchemist as well, and a Swordsmith. Hmm, which one do you play? I feel like you play the Alchemist, right? You know he has Assassinate in hand. Yeah, I think that's what I would do. Plus, the Magistrate's still here, so you gotta worry about that a little bit. Yeah, if he had saved the box that last turn, he would have been able to make Woodwind uh, waste that court games, essentially. So we do see Alchemist with two fate. Uh, Scorpion's going to give up the passing fate to play a couple characters. He doesn't have fate worse than deaths left, so that makes sense. Phoenix Fox bids four here. Uh, I guess he was a little bit worried about the Scorpion one bid, but yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. Um, his hand is still pretty dead, so he needs to see more cards. This does give him an extra honor, though, so probably okay. Um, so with the art, uh, actress, I guess you can pull an investigator. Ooh, it looks like the actress is going to attack, finds Shameful Display, hmm. So you defend with Alchemist and Shameful, right? Yep, that is what we see. Now there's no point really to move home, right? So you probably just pass.
it would take like two cards at least to have a chance of winning this, which seems like it's not worth it. Um, we see, yep, there's the pass. So Scorpion can now use the second attack to just go at Shameful since it's already been used. That's fine. Um, so as Dragon, maybe... Hmm. I think maybe you just wait to see what Scorpion does with the second attack, right? Like, all the rings here are pretty good. So yeah, I would probably just pass here and pass the conflict. Um, you could, yeah, he does pass the conflict. I was going to say you could like go break pilgrimage with Mitsu, I guess, but it makes it harder to defend. Plus, if Scorpion attacks here uh, with something that's not fire, you can use Master Alchemist and then attack fire to get that fate back. Just honor everybody. We could actually see Dragon dropping the bids here coming up. Um, Scorpion is getting a little bit low on honor. However, with the Scorpion Stronghold, that probably is not the best idea still. Um, let's see what Woodwind does. You could again just go for a poke attack uh, and force some kind of defense. Looks like he's going to do more than that though. He does have the favorable ground so he can always move somebody home. Hmm. Yep, so attacking Shameful with the Voidering seems good. Skill 6 here, so if you defend with Investigator, that's 5, 6, 7 after box. Uh, but I'm guessing Scorpion has a way to dishonor you, right? He does still have the Finger of Jade. And he can use Investigator first action, so yeah, maybe you just defend with the Investigator, actually. Yeah, looks like that's what he's going to do. And then you use his action first. Puts it on the Earth Ring. Interesting. Two Assassinate, Bonsai, two Censure, Court Games, four Shame, two Fans. Hmm. So there's actually some not good stuff in here. Whoops. Um, the ornate fans you don't really like, the four shame you don't really like. Interesting that he discards four shame instead of court games because you can finger of jade four shame, but you can't finger of jade court games. Um, I think that might actually be a mistake. Uh, the actress is going to bring in the other investigator though. Forgot about that. Cloud the mind gets played on that immediately. Don't want that happening. If Shameful Display breaks here, that's actually not terrible for a dragon. Um, and the Voidering isn't that terrible either, so you might actually just let this break. Uh, So we saw Woodwind pass. Master Alchemist is going to honor the Investigator. Lots of honor here. So if he does have another political buff, he can probably save this. Still has the Stronghold, but that's not quite enough. Um, but on the other hand, yeah, Scorpion has those two fans and the Court Games, so 
I think this will probably actually break. Like, honestly, I would just let it break at this point, I think. Make him attack into either Sacred Sanctuary or Feast or Famine. Should have clouded the actress before the attack. Yeah, that's true. Uh, maybe he wanted to wait to see if there was a let go that he could hit with the investigator, though. That's a possible concern. Uh, we've only seen one let go from Scorpion so far, so there's still two left in the deck. So that is very much something that you need to worry about. So spends the Mountain's Anvil Castle to pull another fan here, and yeah, at this point, I think we're just going to see the pass. And then Dragon can go Earth here, and the next turn Fire will have two Fate on it, and he can do that. Yeah, so there's the pass. Should be, yep, pass from Scorpion as well. So that will be the break on Shameful Display. Blackmail Artist steals an honor. So now you can just attack with Mitsu. Um, go Earth Ring, probably. And break either one of these. You probably break Pilgrimage, right? See what was in his hand. Bonsai. So you just covert this guy so he doesn't do any kind of shenanigans. Did he play the bonsai actually? No, he didn't. This was in that last conflict. Yeah, so you just covert him, you go military, you break either one. Doesn't really matter. Uh, actually, I would go shameful. Yeah, he's rethinking that. So if you attack pilgrimage, it gives him a fate for free. So you should just go shameful actually. Although, I forgot that there's a favorable ground here. Hmm. Hmm. So if you do go Shameful, he's going to move in and use it. So. And no Pathfinder's Blades left. Hmm. Yeah, he has favorable ground. So you move in, right? There's no reason not to move in. And now he needs a Finger of Jade. If he gets Shamefold here, it's going to be 3 defense to 6 attack. So that's still breaking. Uh, but if the Bonsai comes out, then it won't be enough. So yeah, if you have a Finger of Jade, you should play it. He's going to play a Hurricane Punch instead, though, from the discard pile. I mean, I guess the other thing to be concerned about is that if he does defend Pilgrimage successfully, you don't get the ring effect, and you don't want that. Plus, you're going to be getting a fire ring next turn, most likely, so you can re-honor Mitsu anyway. There is the Shameful Display. So you're still breaking by a good amount. Uh, you could just pass here. Yeah, he does pass. Force him to spend that Bonsai if he wants to try and prevent the break. And then if you have another card, you can just play it. Dragon's going to be on Stronghold as well next turn as first player with the Alchemist to Ryana Mitsu. And it is Entrenched Position. Hmm. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. Phoenix Fox already used the Master Alchemist. Yeah, that's already been used this turn. Uh, I believe it honored the Investigator. So, yep, there's the Bonsai. So Dragon needs another Hurricane Punch now, or another Katana of some sort. Or maybe a Tattooed Wanderer. Uh, he does have the Ancestral Dai Show. that's good.
And that is going to be the break. Woodwind doesn't have any more cards there. So this is pretty good for a dragon. Hits assassinate, that's, eh, it's fine. It's not really anything good in the Scorpion Sand right now, honestly. The only thing you can hit that's decent is court games. Um, ooh, he has the reprieve for the investigator again. That investigator is not going anywhere this game. Um, so yeah, it's actually, it's possible that Phoenix Fox can break the stronghold on his first attack, right? He could actually break it with just Mitsu if there's no defense. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Yeah, it's definitely looking like this might be it. Um, this next turn coming up here. Like, Scorpion just doesn't have a whole lot left that Dragon is even scared of. Hmm. 15 fate, though. Probably just buys everything here. Uh, so Dragon could buy the... Okay, buys the Nintendo Master, that's fine. Uh, does he have any swords left, though? I think he has one katana, and that's it. Mm, that's that's not good. I mean, it's still 3-3 three, three stats. You can honor him, and then he's 5-5. Five, five. Yeah, Scorpion is just going to buy everything here. Um, hmm... See what the bids are. This will be interesting. So Phoenix Fox is going to bid four again to make sure he doesn't drop to really low honor. Um, hmm. So Dragon could just go firing and get the fate. I don't think he can realistically try to break the stronghold here. Uh, we see let go on Daisho, that's good. Like, I think you just want to farm ring effects here and make sure that you still have the better board next turn. Like, get a void ring, void kudaka. Plays a skirmisher, though, so it could be going for the finish, actually. That's two coverts. You can covert Yunako and kudaka, and then he just has one, two, three military skill. Yeah, that might actually do it here. Scorpion already spent both bonsais, I think. Yep. So yeah, I think this might be game. One, four, nine, uh, 15, 18, 20, 20 to three. Yeah, like what could, what could, hmm. I mean, you could have some four shames. Could have a katana. There's not There's not really that much that Scorpion could have here. I think this is just going to be the all-in attack. Uh, you could leave the investigator at home. I think we might see that. That's fair. Goes for fire here. No, it's not Rally, it is um, the other one, Entrenched. So 15 skill coming in, um, 
potentially 20 after Box and Alchemist if he plays another attachment here. We're going to see, yeah, I think this might be the game here for Dragon. Going to break the stronghold. Um, defends with everybody, that's probably correct. Like, you just have to throw out everything you have at this. Uh, it's still probably going to break, but... There's a for shame on Mitsu. Can re-honor with the Alchemist. Another thing Dragon can actually do here is he can use Mitsu. Yeah, we do see that. Uh, he can use Mitsu to play Hawk Tattoo and pull in the Investigator. And then Hawk Tattoo is another plus one, so that would be four extra skill. If he needs to do that. Uh, we see Way of the Scorpion on Mitsu, though. Ooh. So this is kind of risky now. I think he still has a Cunning Magistrate, doesn't he? Yeah, he still has a Cunning Magistrate left, and six cards in hand, five in deck. It's actually likely that he has that. So he could actually just blank Mitsu here, which would be a really big deal. <laughs> Although we probably see that get Void Fisted, right? Assuming he has a Void Fist. He's got to have a Void Fist. There... Uh, we see a Hurricane Punch on Mitsu. There's no Void Fist in the graveyard, but he has 11 cards in hand and 4 in deck. Three of those are Void Fist, so I think the chance that the last three cards in his deck are Void Fist is low. Uh, a lot lower than the chance of Woodwind even having the Cunning Magistrate in his hands to begin with. I think one of them's still on the bottom of the deck because it didn't get shuffled. He replayed it. Uh, but still two left. So I can't imagine. Did he use two with Mitsu? I thought he just played one and then reused that one. So I think there's only one on the bottom. Uh, plays a Hawk tattoo on Mitsu. Wow, getting kind of desperate here. Gets another action now. Okay, there's the first Void Fist. So, yeah, it doesn't matter now because he had one Void Fist, so now he can replay that one um, if the Magistrate does come down. So, yeah, I think this is probably game for Scorpion. It looks like he doesn't have another Four Shame, probably, or he could just be saving that. Uh, if he is saving the Four Shame, that's pretty sick. There's still one left in his deck. I think that's exactly what he needs to not lose. He needs the Four Shame. Number three. Let me check to make sure he has one left. Oh, he doesn't have one. He's already used three. There's an Assassinate on the Hiruma Skirmisher. Um, not going to be enough here. Dragon still has Stronghold and a bunch of cards in hand. Plays a Finger of Jade on Mitsu. Yeah, Woodwin has two Sentry and one Assassinate. That's true. So, uh, the last, so he just played the other Assassinate. So the last two cards in his hand have to be like what could they even be fiery madness would be okay i guess one of them's probably a katana uh there's the cunning magistrate so this gets immediately void fisted right cunning plus forged edict yeah that's true uh, Phoenix Fox could just have the last Void Fist in his hand, though. 
Let's see if the Forge Edict does come out here. Oh, GG. Yeah, that had to be the last card in the sand there. Wait, did he still have court games? I think he might have still had court games. I'm not sure if he ever played that court games that we saw in his hand. Yeah, no, he didn't. So he still had court games. So his last three cards were two century, one court games. So yeah, he just he just didn't have anything there. Um, yeah, wow. Uh, good game there. So Phoenix Fox wins that game. Congratulations to him. He will move on to the semifinals. And he will play against either QQ or Daidoji Mika. Uh, they're playing Dragon and Crane. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, no problem, Phoenix Fox. Uh, congratulations on your win there. Well played. But yeah, I guess I better go uh, get something to eat. Uh, I'm not sure if there are going to be any other games today. Let me check the World Cup real quick. I think most of those finished, right? Still have a couple Belgium versus Sweden, Russia versus Australia. So there are a few left. Shoot hasn't played yet, but I don't know if any of those are even going to be uh, my time. Woodwind and Johnny, I don't think, have played either. But yeah, we'll see, I guess. Um, I'll also have to do the ghost stream later today. But yeah, that's going to do it for this game. Uh, so thanks everybody for watching, and I will see you guys next time.